welcome to World News. Today was supposed to be a normal news day, but it was breaking news about the election which is happening in the UK. Prime Minister David Cameron has hailed new jobless figures which show unemployment is at a seven-year low, although Labour says too many workers are in part-time jobs. The Prime Minister said his government had overseen a jobs miracle, with the UK creating more jobs since 2010 than the rest of the EU combined. Mr Cameron says the UK's employment miracle would be put at risk by Labour. For more on this, I am joined now by my brother Corey. Corey, what can you tell us? Well, like you said, Tom, David Cameron has hailed new jobless figures, which shows unemployment is at a seven-year low, although Labour says too many workers are in part-time jobs. Also, who do you think is going to win the election? Well, there still could be a chance that David Cameron might win. And I'm not sure if there's a chance that Ed Miliband might win. We are not too sure, actually. I might need to wait until the results are out. And finally, before we move on, Corey, what did Mr Cameron say about the UK's employment? Well then, uh, Mr Cameron says the UK's employment miracle would be put at risk by Labour. And like I said, I need to wait until the results are out. OK, thank you so much, Corey, for joining us on the show. No problem, Tom. Bye! So to recap, unemployment fell by 76,000 to 1.84 million in the three months to February, official statistics show. But Labour's Chuka Amana accused the Tories of ignoring low pay growth. The economy has moved centre stage again after Thursday's TV election debate in which Mr Miliband and four other party leaders clashed over the defect. Immigration, health and defence, but in which Mr Cameron did not take part. That's the breaking news for today. We'd like to thank you for watching. Please subscribe, comment, like and share this video which the buttons are listed down below. And see you next time. I am Tom. And I am Ben, and we will see you next Saturday.